Hi and welcome back to the channel and thank you so much for clicking into this video. So in this video, I'm going to teach you how to fix Steam Disk Read Error. So make sure that you stay until the very end of this video so you don't miss an important step or information. And without further ado, let's get on it. So the first tip that you can do is to update the driver. So to do that on your search bar, just type settings and click on to the update and security. So choose the Windows update and click on to the check for updates selection and just wait for the update to complete. And if an update is published in the Windows update service, updates will be automatically downloaded and installed. And that's it for the first tip. And the next tip is to delete the zero KB file. So to do that, just press the Windows plus R key on your keyboard to launch the run interface, key in the command percent program files percent and then just press or enter, press the enter button on your keyboard on to and on the new window that appears, just simply find the Steam and then go to Steam apps and then go to the common and scroll through the list and find the zero KB file. So highlight and press delete. So just repeat the installation or update on Steam. And then for the next tip is to delete corrupted log files. So to do this, just repeat this first uh, this first step and second step on this tip right here. And after doing so, just find the Steam and then go into the logs and then go to the content log. So as you can see here, this, the, it, this is the content log. And open the file by double clicking and scroll through the list. So if you see a failed to write error, go to the file path. Locate it by a file name and then delete the file. And then after doing so, just try reinstalling or updating again. And then lastly, what you can do is to verify integrity of game files. And to do this on the Steam Desktop app, you need to go to the Library tab and select the game that received the disk write error. And the right click to, and right click it and then choose the properties and then navigate to the local files and then verify the integrity of game files and wait for the process to finish and then close and close the steam app and then just relaunch steam and proceed with the game installation or update and so that's it for this video remember you can always pause this video or go back to the video and follow the steps at your own time so i hope this helped you and if it did please make sure to like subscribe and hit notification bell button so you won't miss a video thank you so much for watching and have a great day Bye bye